Hi you guys, what's up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It is Sunday morning. It's 8.30. I woke up at around 7.30. So I'm gonna do some yoga and um, but I'm gonna make my morning lemon water first. What's the weather like today? It's currently cloudy and 75 degrees. Today's high will be 82 degrees and the low will be 75. Love that. coffee yet. I need to make my coffee. Just doing a regular shot of espresso. I think this is about ready to empty. So I'm going to empty it. Yeah, it's kind of rainy outside. Kind of gross. A little dark. gonna go to the store i just have like a really short list and then next weekend christian and i are doing a huge restock of basically everything we're going to trader joe's and um Publix and like just restocking on everything we go to trader joe's like once a month and we just stock up on frozen stuff which makes it really easy picking dinner so So this is my breakfast and I'm going to eat this and then I uh, will talk to you guys after. So I just got back from Publix. Are there a lot of noises in the background? Can you like hear everything basically? Okay, I just paused that. I'll just restart the dishwasher and dryer when I'm done. But anyways, I'm gonna recreate the Starbucks vanilla sweet cream cold foam. I found a whole blog post on it. I'm not gonna do um, the cold brew with it because I'm just gonna do regular coffee and just make it ice. I got the ingredients. I already had vanilla extract, but I got, I'm physically recreating this whole thing because I even got the same exact cups that she had yesterday at Target. So you just need condensed milk and heavy cream. I already had um, vanilla extract, but, and then you just need condensed milk and heavy cream. 
It's so funny. Here, let me show you the cups. So, this is the... Can you see? This is the cup that she used. I went to Target yesterday and got these. They're pub glasses. They look exactly like these glasses here. Um, I already washed them and put them away, but can you even tell? So I went and bought those glasses just so I could actually recreate her recreation of it plus i liked the glasses they're cute and they were there's six of them for eleven dollars they're meant for beer glasses which is funny meant for beer but which is funny because these like crate and barrel glasses that i get like a ton of tons of questions on they're super cute they're like a can shape they're beer glasses as well so i got them off crate and barrel they're more expensive for four glasses. I just loved how these were just a plain glass. They have that little ridge. And it was a set of six for $11 at Target. Um, so I thought that was cool. So I'm like basically recreating her recreation of Starbucks using the cup and everything like that. So I don't even know if you're supposed to shake this, but here I am shaking it. Anyways, okay, let's make this. So but I saved the box so I could show you guys, but this is what it looks like it's just a pub glass set so six of them dishwasher safe 11 bucks you really can't beat that so I thought it was funny how I found them at Target <laughs> okay so let's get my cup out I don't think I'm gonna pour the coffee directly into that cup I'm gonna pour the coffee into this first but let me make the actually let me make the coffee first so I'm gonna have to open a box of my Malazio pods because I don't have them open yet. I'm just gonna use like the basic Malazio coffee just to keep it on the plain side because I am putting vanilla cold foam on top and I just don't want it to mix any flavors. I just don't wanna mix other flavors. I kinda wanna keep it plain. Okay, I'm just gonna make just coffee and I'll let that do its thing. Okay, so now that this is, I'm gonna like maybe like stick this in the freezer so that way it like gets cold. So I put that in the freezer. Now I'm gonna put together my little foam and I'm gonna use my so I'm gonna use my frother because I don't it says to use a blender I feel like putting it in a frother is fine and I'll just put it on the cold setting so half a cup of sweetened condensed milk that is thick do you think this is gonna like ruin my frother do you think that's why they say like put it in a blender Maybe I should blend it. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to put it in this. Okay, and then a cup of heavy whipping cream. A teaspoon of vanilla. It's Please pray with me that my frother didn't just break, you know, or that I just didn't break it. I'm going to hold it down and do the cold setting. It's not even spinning. It's not spinning. We're going to put this in a blender. Okay, we're going to first whisk it together. I guess you have to use a blender with this. So learn from me, you have to use a blender or else it just won't even whisk together. <laughs> won't even work. Okay, let me whisk this together. Let's 
try this. It made it. Okay. So I have my coffee. Let me put. Every time I pour out of a glass, it makes a mess. Let me, let's add some cinnamon. Cute. Starbucks barista who? Oh my gosh. Looks so good. I just added cinnamon on top because why not? Now I'm gonna take a few photos. Because what? That is so cute. It is so good. I feel like I'm drinking a treat. Please try this at home. It's so good. I like it better than Starbucks. And I didn't add anything into the coffee because honestly, you really don't need it. Depending on how much of the sweet cream you put on top, you really don't need to add anything in because it drips down into the coffee and teaspoon of vanilla extract in there so it just like adds flavor and then you can just sprinkle some cinnamon on top or leave it how it is but it's so good it's starting to get dark outside i am watching brooke michio and i'm drinking some sparkling water that christian got from his job he got like two cases of it um we have some in the fridge so i just thought i would drink some of it but yeah, this, this is this is what I'm doing. He should be home really soon. And then we'll figure out what we're doing for dinner. I don't know if this is embarrassing or not, but I've been listening to like Christmas music on the piano and it's really calming and relaxing. But I came over to my dad's side of town because he has a fresh kitchen by him. I will, um, Christian's back in town by the way, and I will show you what i got when i get back but yeah i've been just obsessed <laughs> why is it showing up like that i don't know why it does that but yeah i've just been obsessed with listening to christmas music on maybe we'll show up on here better but yeah, I can't find the specific album that I used to listen to. I remember it being called The Christmas Piano, but I can't find it. You can't even see what I got, but brown rice, almond chicken, Brussels sprouts, mm. uh, broccoli, and then like a kale salad underneath. 